amazing party planned, and she might be kicking it off with some popcorn. can't be healthy. Not us. Well, it's Monday. It's 8 o'clock. Well, you know where you are. You're in your kitchen. Miss Sarah, you got to come over. I have healthy shaved Brussels sprout salad. I'll be posting that recipe later. My recipe of the week is healthy snacking with popcorn. And when I said, who says that snacking? And savory can't be healthy, not us, because we have not only from our exclusive Kitchen HQ line, this is brand new. I am going to be ordering this during this show. Actually, I'm probably gonna get a couple of them. I do infused water every day, but it has never been so simple, never been so easy. But the thing is, not just infused spa-like water, you can do iced coffees, you could do infused iced teas, and you can do it with the best, this is that Triton, the stuff that an elephant can stand on and not hurt. It's Shannon proof. That's gonna be coming up for the first time ever in this show. And then when we said healthy cooking, healthy eating, healthy snacking. Oh, thank you. <laughs> she moves like the wind, ladies and gentlemen. I'm like the bionic woman without sound effects. <laughs> <laughs> but we've also got for you a birthday bash extravaganza. This is Italian made quality. Not only is it smeg, they have this great little retro design. There are only, I think just a little over a thousand of these available. That birthday box is also included with your purchase. It also has, a, oh, it, by the way, that blue, that retro blue, it is last call already, but I hear the sound of something that makes me happy. It's not just you being here in, in your kitchen, but it is Stephanie Roberts. And I have to say, popcorn is its, has its own special place on my food pyramid. Absolutely. Popcorn makes me happy. <laughs> but what's so funny is when we think about popcorn, we forget it's got the fiber. It's got that, you know, a lot of healthy carbs. But what isn't so healthy is how we're usually making it and how we're usually popping it, right? Does this look healthy on any level? No, and this is how most of us are making our popcorn. Don't do it. Dash is making it better. So what I love about Dash's new hot air popper is that we are taking out all of the goo, of course, in fun Dash colors. Of course. Because that's how we do things. You, you do. By the way, there's that. Uh, Rick, this week, are we calling it mint? We always get very creative. We're calling this it week, Aqua. Aqua this week. So we have the aqua or we have the red. So the hot air, of course, eliminates the fat, the preservatives, all the oil, all Absolutely. those extra calories. And anything else you don't want in right. it. Because when you unprocess your food with Dash, which is exactly how they want you to do everything, literally all we are doing... Okay, I'm just telling you, this is fun. That's the sound of happiness right there. And look at it pour over. Does your microwave do that? It's not supposed to, <laughs> but your hot air popper will. Oh, look at so that. two things I love. Do you know what's in here? Popcorn, and that is it. it and is. it will never taste better. It will be so clean. And by the way, the smell of fresh paste popcorn, not the gross fake butter kind, right. not the kind where it burns because you've cooked it for too long. You did. But, and by the way, yes, you can That's touch stay, this stay cool as design. we're cooking. It nice. is absolutely stay cool. But what you will oh, notice, fabulous. I want to take this and bring it. Are we done? We're done. <laughs> you hate to go too soon. Look at this. No unpopped kernels. None. Not one of them is brown in color. They are all perfectly even. So this is why you do the hot air popcorn because it makes it perfect each and every time. But what has made this so much fun and what I want everybody to understand is when we're talking about healthy snacking, it does not mean boring. Nope. We don't do boring. We don't do boring. By the way, Azudi, all my pan addicts are in the house. So hello to all of my top friends and fans, Leo and Selene, my kitchen boo, Leo and Greg, of course, Junior, Alicia. So good to see you guys. Selene, thank you. Uh, this is actually, my top is from my personal collection. Sharon loves that dash. And Kate loves it as well. Here's the thing, guys. When we said the whole theme for this show is healthy eating, healthy snacking, the thing is you feel like you're cheating. Now, by the way, you'll see some of my tips over to the side where I'm doing healthy trail mix popcorn as my recipe of the week. 
you can add sweet, you can add savory, you can add garlic powder or rosemary, even a touch of cinnamon or nutmeg. Have some fun with your popcorn. And Stephanie, like you said, even if you add something as simple as that everything, you know, that bagel seasoning. Yes, so this is called everything bagel seasoning. You mm. will be able to find this spice mix in most every grocery store. It is such a fun way to add some different things to your popcorn. So I did add a little butter, and I'll be honest, I'm using the real deal. Because you, you know what? It has less of the chemical it in it than the fake deal. So what I like about Dash is they're giving us the ability to melt the butter right yeah. here on top. On top, talk about energy conservation. So I'm 1,400 watts of power, which is why I am able to get 16 cups of popcorn oh, wow. in minutes. We timed this. This bowl holds about eight cups, and we did it in under three minutes. And My three microwave minutes. does not go that and quickly. And because you're saving so many calories on the oil, and let's be honest, that residue that you see in the microwave bags, yeah. you don't want to be ingesting that. Feel free. Yeah, you can add a little popcorn. Hey, by the way, here's another tip for your air pop popcorn. Use clarified butter. Melt your butter in your microwave. Let that sediment go to the top. And then what's left is called clarified. Once you put that on your popcorn, it doesn't get as soggy and you get that nice little sticky factor, factor without it being just a little too wet. So and that's you another can, tip. I love that tip. And you can control everything you put on this. Someone wants a little extra salt, you can do that. But look at the difference just in the appearance. So these are white kernels, so that gives you that snow no white popcorn. By the way, talk about an economical snack. I can buy these in bulk and then have my white kernels. I can, can have my yellow kernels. Kernels come in all sorts of different colors. That's a look at what the yellow ones For are. Sure. But They've I got do, blue. we've got blues and reds and Everything. all sorts of different colors. Hey, by the way, Rick, if it's okay, I'd love to show the quantity left uh, because all of our pan addicts are there. Patricia, Carrie, Carrie is coming up with the smeg, by the way. Uh, Aaron loves the popcorn. Vicki, hello. Uh, Carrie, uh, uh, who you'll see with Smeg actually likes wing sauce and celery salt, but we only have 1,500 of these. So remember, you choose it in the mint, in the mink. Yeah, that'd be a color. <laughs> the mint, or of course that great red. It is for I'm this sure show. Aqua. Oh, aqua. Getting so fancy. The voice you know, from above. Exactly. I always listen to the voice from above. And you can't screw up the measurements, You right? can't screw up anything. Dash is making this as easy as possible. So the butter melter on the top becomes my measuring cup. I can fill it all the way for 16 cups. But I gotta warn you, that's a lot of popcorn. It is a lot of so popcorn. So if you're gonna fill it all the way, make sure you have a really big bowl. Right. Piece of advice, because I underestimated that 16 cups is a lot of popcorn. It is. So suddenly I can feed the entire crew in just minutes. Now the top of this easily pops off. It's got two little grooves on the side here. So then I can just go ahead and load on in. Right. By the way, both of these two items are dishwasher right. safe. And remember, since you're not using oil in the carafe per se, exactly. there's, there's really no cleanup. Because when you think about cleaning a popcorn popper, it's the oil that you have Absolutely. to clean up. No, honestly, if I don't use butter, I don't even have to wash it. Right. I can wipe it off with a dry cloth. If I use butter, I'm going to pop it in the dishwasher. Two little grooves on the side, puts my top back on. That can just sit there because let's make one without butter but I can put the butter in there because remember the heat does it. It does. Toggle button on the side, off, on, that is it. But when I say we don't have to stop having fun just because we're having a healthy snack, I gotta show you some new things okay. I've learned. So a great thing to do with popcorn, and I'm sure you're familiar with the concept, is to take those discs of colored white chocolate. Okay. They come in any craft store, most of the big box stores. You can then drizzle and toss the popcorn in those and do different flavors flavors and different decorations. Oh, that's a good tip. But I got to show you something okay. I just learned about today. I had no idea this even existed and I can't wait to share you. We can take spray color. Did you know this existed? Okay, no, I have seen those, but I never thought about putting it on popcorn. 100% edible. Oh. Why not put it in popcorn? Because I'll be honest, what you see here with the melted discs, that's a little bit of work. Right. Uh, you know what? Right. That, that kind of goes above my, it's a weekday and I'm not that much fun level of work. Hey, I'm all about honesty here. But this, you're gonna love. Watch what happens here. Oh, how fun! So I can turn this blue, and then I can toss it all around and turn it all blue. This is 100% oh, so cool. edible. I can turn a little bit more of it purple. So you're doing rainbow popcorn. You you're can do whatever you want. Unicorn popcorn. Yes, unicorn popcorn is oh, the kids are gonna lose their minds. Extremely popular. And here's the thing: there's no flavor in this. Right. It's, it's just, just a color. So nobody's gonna turn up their nose no. and say, "Oh, I don't 
like that. But now think of everything you can do. But the, how The pre-gaming, get the colors of your team, the birthday parties, get your kids' favorite colors, and then you can put it in the little bags. Cute. Okay, I'm all about economy. This is literally pennies. It is. And everybody thinks you're so cute and so crafty, True. and it was so and easy. And it's as goof-proof as it gets. By the way, Aaron wants it. Leo, yeah, you got it. We're, all we're missing is a, a beverage of choice. Vicki, hello to you. Patricia, you're right. It's easy to clean. Donna, I love your idea. Garlic and onion powder. Adrian, thank you. Great to see you there. Sharon says it's always her favorite. Our foodies, Aaron and Vicki and Amanda Rice, you know I love you. Family and popcorn movie night will never be the same. Well, what about parties and setting up a popcorn bar? Little bit healthier yeah. than straight candy. We are going to mix some candy in with our popcorn. We can add peanuts. We can add, oh, the gummy worms have been very popular behind the scenes with the crew. The pretzels, you can mix it all in. So use this as part of your party. Right. It is a healthy snack. You can provide the little bags. You can. And everybody's good to go. I did get another suggestion from the ladies in the kitchen that okay. I'm really kind of excited about. Let's use a little bit of butter just right. to get it a little bit moistened right. up. Which, by the way, you can also use one of those nonstick sprays. You can use a spray right. and then just a little. This one's a little more decadent, but I'll be oh, light-handed. Sure. Cinnamon <gasps> sugar. Oh, because wow. here's the deal. Many of us love a churro. But oh, what's a churro? Right. A churro's deep fried. I don't want a deep fried, but there's just something about a little bit of butter right. and a little cinnamon sugar. I gotta tell you, this is one of my new little addictions. It's like churro popcorn. Churro popcorn. That's awesome. All right, yeah, Vicki, uh, Lee is saying her oldest son moved to Colorado with it. It is family popcorn night, family movie night. will never look the same way ever again. Dash, you know they stand for quality. You pick that aqua or the red. Just a little over a thousand to go around. This show for $12.48, 671561. Uh, and remember, healthy snacking is what we're all about in this hour. Check out details. It's going to be on HSN's Facebook, our healthy trail mix. I love what you've done. You've added the apricots, the berries, the nuts, the healthy sweets to our popcorn. Send your kids to college with this yes. to keep them out of those bags full of gunk. Unprocess your foods, but keep the sweet treats. I love the creativity yeah, you did there. That's a very good idea. Fun. Well, thank you, Stephanie. Good to see you as very always. Very good to do this. Save that popcorn. I got a lot for got you. my name on it. Thank you. <laughs> all right. Thank you to Stephanie. Good and to thanks to all of our... Do you know, you guys, when I say this is your kitchen, you know that's the truth. It really is. Uh, you know, from Azuti to Celine to Vicky to Amanda, you know, we've got all of our pan addicts and fan addicts and kitchen booze in the house. We're really kind of creating a brand new community here at HSN. And no kidding, you guys make my week every night of the week, but especially on Mondays in your kitchen. Hey, if you want to be part of our VIP card holders only during birthday month, we run this $25 off promotion when you apply and buy on your HSN cards. So check out details on hsn.com. Oh, Carrie, good to see you joining the party. Love that little cheese packet from the macaroni and cheese. Wendy, good to see you. My friend Wendy on Facebook, you know I always love hearing from you. So if you're ready, we do things in your kitchen that's a little out of the box, and we are doing this for this show. That means cha-ching! You are getting not only an exclusive price, a first come first serve offer, free shipping for this show, and a two pay flex pay on something that's brand new to HSN. Kitchen HQ is our proprietary brand, and they do think out of the box and create things exclusively for you. Uh, you'll have to forgive me, once I get Chris turned loose, I'm gonna order a couple of these. It is the infused three-in-one pitcher. Now you just pick your color of choice. We've got this great teal, the, the blue, or the red. Here's your info, infusing insert, and Chris will speak to that. On the bottom, now how genius is this, is a little freezable disc. So if you wanna do your iced coffees, your infused iced teas, your green teas, then of course, speaking of those teas, there's a little tea infuser that's also included with your purchase. So Chris is back, and Chris, I tell you, first of all, it's great to have you Hi, in your kitchen. Oh, I'm so glad to be here. I am so wild about this, no kidding. I, <laughs> forgive me, I do have to grab my phone because I'm gonna order a couple of these. Because no, I do infused water every day yes. and there are a whole multitude of health benefits that go along with infused water plus it just promotes uh, hydration yes but I do a lot of mint and sometimes the seeds from the lemons oh. things get caught in your teeth 
This is the easiest way to do infusions ever, ever, ever on the planet. You know, this is one of those items where we just took something that everyone loves and put every consideration into it. So what you're looking at is a three-quart pitcher. You guys at home said that you wanted a three-quart pitcher that also fits nicely into your refrigerator. So look at the silhouette here. It's so nicely done. The reason why I keep turning it upside down is because it's completely leak-proof, all right? It is leak-proof. You don't have to worry about this. Now, like Shannon said, it's made from Triton, which is a durable, extra hard, shatter resistant material. I mean, look at this. You hear that? It's not breaking. Try doing that with your plastic, your porcelain, your glass pitchers. You couldn't. So yes, it's very Shannon proof, okay? okay. <laughs> On top Add of that. Add to cart, yes. express <laughs> She's bar. buying it right now. She's buying three. <laughs> so two. this is the infuser. This is what's going to make all of those flavored waters. And I'm gonna get you some great ideas, but this actually locks into place. You're also going to get what she, call, what she talked about, the steeper. So yes, iced teas, iced coffees, you will be able to make them and infuse them. And the best part about all of this is it's completely dishwasher safe. Now, I personally think that hand washing, you'll get the most life out of it, but if you want to pour it in the dishwasher, you can. But Shannon, it is already nighttime, so I'm gonna go ahead and pour for you okay. a beautiful sangria. Okay, because- Sorry you're getting so much screen time here, Chris. Like I said, I wanna make sure I get my order. <laughs> She's really ordering this, no, guys, I'm serious just in because, case you're wondering. But you know what's so funny? I saw this in the hall, and I, I had my fingers crossed. I thought, oh, I hope I get this, because yes, you could do sangrias. You could do iced coffees. You could do iced teas. Now, by the way, and certainly I'm no Andrew Lessman, but I've learned a lot over my, you know, over almost 25 years here at HSN. Infused waters have a lot of health benefits. Uh, for someone like me, I mean, if you want, you know, kind of those spa-like detoxifying benefits, you add a little lemon. If you want refreshing, sometimes for ginger, for like soothing properties, I'm a little tummy tum tum. I'll put a little mint or I'll put a little ginger. And remember, you don't have to worry about sediment. You don't have to worry about draining. You don't have to worry about little seeds getting um, stuck in your teeth. And listen, I think we can all agree, you, we should all be drinking more water. Yes. But if you know, if you're not doing that because the flavor isn't so great, this gives you that upscale spa water. Chris, I know you've done it too. Anytime yes. you go to one of those great, you know, spa, med spas, they always have that spa water. Yes. And it always tastes so good. So this is what this is what we call a detox water. This is cucumber slices, lemon, mint, and ginger. And I'm telling you, if you slice up your fruit, you slice up your vegetables, you, you would place it in the infuser and the infuser actually just locks just into place genius. like this. You can actually, oh, that's so smart. if you keep the fruit and, and, and vegetables infused in the water, yeah. you can actually leave this for two weeks. Oh, can you really? Up to 14 days oh, wow. in your refrigerator. So every time you take the water or liquid out, you just add more in. And the, the stronger you like it, the more fruit you put in, sure. the better it'll taste, the it, longer infused it there. So Rick, which, which color will sell out first? So I actually I, I actually got the red and the teal because I, I, I do infused waters every day, but when I do them, they're not as easy as this. Plus this is so pretty. Just seeing that fruit or mint or ginger or, uh, <laughs> so there you go. I got, the, I got both the teal and the red. So uh, honestly, Claudia, if that answers your question, cucumber water is great. Junior's asking about tea bags. I would say absolutely, well, right? Well, you know, what I would do for this, because the steeper is made for loose teas, oh. cut open the teas and put that in the steeper and then go ahead and great pour your tip. hot water on here. Oh, that's now, a great this tip. is a summertime favorite. This is margarita mix, okay? This is your favorite margarita mix. We've <gasps> infused it with jalapeno oh, and a that's little a bit idea. more, I know, and a little bit more lime. And of course, down here at the bottom, I have that ice pack. So I can actually, that ice pack is so small. I mean, I can just pull it, I'll show it, pull it out right here, but okay. you can just leave it in the freezer oh, because it's so small that you could leave that, that in the freezer. So cool. And then when you're ready to serve, you just go ahead, pop it into the bottom, and now your pitcher is ready to go. It, it is indeed. Uh, Aaron, you're right. For grill nights, this is perfect. Uh, Selene, you're right. If you don't like plain water, this is perfect. 
we all know we should be hydrating more. We all know we should be drinking more water. And not only does this give you that incentive, because it, it jazzes up that water. That's what they do in all those high-end hotels and spas. But even things like your iced coffees. I know retail values vary, but at my coffee shop, they're charging between 3 and $6 for an iced coffee, which I think is crazy. So you take your favorite coffee, and maybe you're someone like me. I like a little more savory aspect to my coffee. So whether it's cinnamon sticks, sometimes I even add lavender. I love the cinnamon so stick the, idea. The cinnamon sticks are fantastic. And you know, there are a whole multitude of health benefits that go along with an infusion of coffee or water. And uh, a lot of you are talking about that on our Facebook Live because this is your kitchen. Remember, for this show, you are getting that two pay flex pay and you're also getting that free shipping. So you get first dibs. There are not a lot of these to go around. What is this lovely thing? So this is iced tea, okay? Oh, yeah. So we were talking about iced tea and you do get a steeper, which is so interesting. I think you, you see so many pictures and you don't get that. So the way the steeper works is you fill it with tea or coffee to however strong you want it. And then you place it in the pitcher and then it screws right in, right. like just like that. Right. And overnight you'll have iced coffee. Now right. this happens to be iced tea. Oh, sure. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this out and look at this. I filled the infuser <gasps> oh. with lemons and peaches. Absolutely. Hey, <laughs> Wendy, my friend Wendy on Facebook, uh, excellent question. She's like, I'm not sure what an infusion is. This is the secret to infusing. Infusing just means that um, you Sub take... You submerging it completely in the liquid. There you go. So now I want to um, re recommend that you cut your, your fruits and vegetables that you use because the more you cut them, the more they'll release their flavor. Makes sense. Exactly. So what this is, why this is so important is it goes right into the center of the pitcher and it actually locks into place. Right. You just turn it and screw Which, it. Which, by the way, Scott, that was one of the questions. So, you know, tighten it if you, you want to make sure yes. it's in there nice and tight. If you're going to be pouring from this, which which you are. Right. And then you just do the same thing with the top, right? Yes, so you screw that in. And here's the thing, guys. If you don't want to flavor your water, fill the infuser with ice. Oh, sure. And it'll keep your Why ice, your, your pitcher completely cold and it'll keep it really ice. But what you'll do is you'll go ahead and Say. fill it up. Oh, boy. Oh, We've got, I, oh, boy. I love how Keith and Jenny go for the adult beverages. Are, that's the sangria. The sangria okay. is gone. The sangria is spoken <laughs> for everyone. It is gone. Okay, remember you're still on the clock for a couple more hours. <laughs> so. But here, but while the sangria takes a walk, I'm going to pour Shannon some of this peach-infused ice Tea. Oh, whoopsie, see? See, I wasn't so, paying attention and the lid so fell Scott, off. So, Scott, there you go. You gotta, you know, you gotta tighten the top. <laughs> so, use your error. You do and that was my bad. You know, use your error. at them, and it... <laughs> Totally happened. See, we get a little <laughs> distracted in your kitchen. We uh, do, but if when, when the lid's on completely tight, you can turn it upside down. All right? There you go. I so. was not paying attention. I was looking at the burglars. There right? you go. Hey, so. uh, the queen missed this. Uh, can you add hot water to this? Great question. Yes, you can. You can put hot water in. So if you want to make hot tea or if you want to make hot coffee, great, great question. Yes, you can. It is temperature resistant. There you go. And of course, that Triton, that BPA, really the best of the best of the best. The red will sell out first, then we've got that teal, and then of course that blue. I actually got two of them, making my job so much easier in the kitchen, and chances are yours as well. And then, promoting that hydration, hot or cold. Uh, Wendy, again, infusion, just submerge that little basket that Chris is showing you, and then you get that wonderful flavor enhancement. Chris, great job, thank you. Thank Good you, to see Shannon, you. great to see you. All right, I, I wanna know where that sangria went, because you know, once <laughs> I'm done with my show, <laughs> Live it's television, on. folks. It's Live on. television. Exactly. <laughs> love you, Chris. I love Thank you, you. Too, Shannon. Hey, by the way, our smart deal at the end of the show will be from Smeg. I, I know Carrie. Ka Carrie, I love her. She's even been on the Facebook Live chat. Remember, it is coming up with an HSN exclusive birthday bash and extravaganza. The pastel blue, it is actually last call, last call. So you're welcome to grab it. It's that exclusive flow technology. It's Italian made design, great retro colors as well. Well, thanks again for joining us in your kitchen. We do this every Monday night at eight o'clock and you really are the stars of the show. So thanks again for building that community at large. Uh, well, it wouldn't be a party unless John was here and Hello? we're talking about taking and making some of your favorites healthy. We did, or even healthier. We did water, we did popcorn. But John, let's be honest, yes. we like meatballs, we like bacon, right. we like hamburger, but we don't like all the extra fat and leave it to our exclusive brand name of Kitchen HQ to give us the flavor 
without the fat, That's right? exactly right. What's so great about this pan, it's a 100% aluminum uh, molded pan, nice. okay? And it's got a divider here that literally is a strainer. So now without your food coming out, you can literally strain the pan. Oh, that's what genius. I love about this, you can pour out a little bit or a lot. If you want your bacon to come out really crispy, yeah. you can get it all the way out. By the way, they all come with their own lid, a glass Beautiful. lid. Beautiful. What I love about this, you can seal the lid by turning it. Oh, wow. There's a little, you'll see when, you can't really see it on the black here, but there's little arrows, okay? When nice. you line this up with a pour spout, I can literally strain every ounce of fat off of that bacon and it all stays inside the pan. So now, you know how we used to do it, right? I mean, right. if you want good crispy bacon, you gotta get that fat off yes, because you, you do. don't want it soaking and, and all that and saturating in that bacon. It, it's so true. now you can take that off. Now, I gotta show you this because they do come with the lids, but what I love about it too, on taco night, yeah. when you're doing ground beef in a frying pan on your stove at home, I mean, listen, it, even when you buy that uh, the, the really super lean beef, yeah, ground beef, still you fat. always get that fat in there. You do. Now, all you're gonna do, you can see this little divider, okay? That's now, these so are cool. removable, so okay. if you wanna use it as a regular pan, you can. Yeah. But with the lid on top like this, you turn it so that little arrow is right to the edge, and look at this, I can literally strain every ounce of fat off of that and I'm not wasting any meat. If you've ever done this and had to throw out like, you know, half of your ground beef because it all falls out while you're trying to strain all the grease off, now you don't have to worry about that. You can literally see it, how much, look how much is in there. You can still see it on that glass lid. Wow. I'm gonna strain it completely down because I don't like all that all that extra fat or that extra grease but you got all the on flavor. my tacos, but it does leave all the flavor. That's and brilliant. Now, now that you've got all that off of there, yeah. I can actually remove this, okay? I can remove this piece oh, and handy. use it as a regular fry pan. Oh, nice. So now I can take my water, and the seasoning and add it to this sure. to make my taco. Hey, let me just show you the colors of choice. And remember, yeah, you're absolutely right. Remember, we are Facebooking live. You guys are a community. Um, honestly, Erin loves that colander. Vicki got her red pitcher. Patricia said it's worth it for the ground beef alone. Yes. So here's your choice. Now remember, this is an HSN exclusive, brilliant red, that's great teal or the black. And I know John was showing you this earlier, but here's what the interior looks like. It's a perfect capacity. For me, this is kind of the Goldilocks pan yep. because you know that way you've got that extra depth as well. So there's, a, to Aaron was point, can you guys see, there's that built-in colander, but it is removable, it is removable. So then it just slides back in and there's your cook and look lid. Remember, you just give it a little twist and that kind of locks it down. And with that nice, this is a silicone-based handle, so it has more of that stay-cool design. And John, I think this yes. is really key for a lot of people because we all want that flavor. We just don't want things sitting in that fat. And, yes. and frankly, draining that grease can be kind of a hazard well, and, and it's hard to do. You mentioned too, it's a three and a half quart capacity. It's nice. So it's nice tall sides. So I can literally boil pasta in the fry pan right on the stove. And I gotta show you this because now I can, I'm gonna go back over here. Let me get a bowl because there's a little bit of water in right. this one. I'm gonna pour this into a bowl, take it right to your sink, okay? Without having to pull out and dirty up a colander, now, I can drain oh, my pasta, so okay, <laughs> and, yeah. and not have to worry about losing any of it because everything drains out perfectly with no splashing. You don't have to worry about grease right. splatter because you have that lid, and that lid is it's a see-through lid. It is. Okay, with well, a silicone rim that gives it a perfect seal. So that's a silicone rim. It is cast aluminum. We all recognize that aluminum is the great, you know, conductor of heat. It is very lightweight, and by the way, we're getting questions on, on oven. You can use it in the oven with the pan, with Without the lid on, it's 500 degrees. I would, I would recommend not using it in the oven right. and not using it on like a barbecue or right. uh, or a microwave. Okay, well, yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> yeah, it's made for the stove top, but the, it's got a great nonstick inside too. And the re, I love it for the nonstick. It cleans out easily. But I tell you what, I'm gonna throw, let's see, I'm gonna throw. Okay. By the way, it is induction friendly, and I'll show you that bottom. So here's oh, yeah, uh, here's that induction friendly bottom. So remember, you yes. get that nice deep reservoir. That colander insert is removable, so yep. you can use it as you know a, a basic nice uh, deep depth pan. 
but you're getting it for this show for $13.32 on your credit card. Erin, it is dishwasher safe. Oh, yeah. Uh, Olympia, hello to you as well. Leo would use it for sloppy joes. Oh, yeah. Ooh, for the ground for beef. Meatballs. Look at this. I did meatballs in here. There's like 24, maybe maybe 30-some meatballs in here. Nice. Uh, what, what I love about it is you keep the flavor in there. You're not taking it away, okay, but you're not having to eat all that saturated uh, fats that are in your food because Good of that, point. you're pouring it away. You, so now I can take the lid off the pan. I can remove the, you can, this is what I love about it. I can literally remove this and use it as a regular pan. Perfect. Now this little strainer, I'll show you this in a second, but I love this because now I can take my marinara sauce, oh, pour it right that. over the meatballs. Nice. And for your pasta dish, now I can heat that up evenly. Again, 100% uh, aluminum. Right. Okay, you've got the, the it's, it's a grippy handle on it, okay? It's a very comfortable handle, easy to use. It's a super lightweight pan. It is. But what I love about it too is, let's see, I can mix these up in the pan, use it as a regular pan. So if you wanted to do four hamburgers in here and strain away all the extra grease and fat, you, you can, can do that. You if can. You wanna, if you I... wanna do pasta, you can strain away all the ex excess water and have perfect pasta without having to, to take out a, 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 a colander. Hey, by the way, this is uh, you know, Olympia Good to see you there. Uh, Selene Jr. and Selene were wondering, you know, how heavy is it? Because it's cast aluminum, it is not a heavy pan. It's not a heavy pan, but it is induction friendly with that silicone seal. And then of course the removable colander so that you can put it, uh, you know, use it as a regular pan as well. Uh, Rosalinda, nice to have you there. Actually now June, um, uh, uh, at least our details on hsn.com do say that you can put it in the oven. Uh, you know, John is recommending oh, no, but yep. at least our details on hsn.com are. Uh, I've never tried it in the oven. Okay. So so I, that's why I say that. Right. I, and uh, again, if, if you do, it's probably low heat. Uh, right. Yep. So uh, at least our details on hsn.com do specify that you can use it in the oven. It is induction friendly. Yes. So, so just you, keep you have that gas, in mind. electric, or induction, it works on all of them. But again, it saves you so much time. And this is where Kitchen HQ really shines. We take all the best qualities of all, all these different products. I've only seen one other pan on the market like this, and, it, and the strainer is built right. into it. It's Absolutely. built over the top. You can't put a lid on it, and it's built over the top. It well, is. now you, you're losing half your pan. Y because you, you can remove that strainer, you don't have to worry about that. And take a look at this. Here, we, we parboiled some potatoes, okay? I'm gonna grab the lid. Okay. And look at this, or if you want to blanch your potatoes, right. I'm going to go way over here because my bowl is way over here. Okay. Again, you can pour some of this out. Oh, that's a great okay? idea. Hey, and you can leave a little bit in there if you want to, to mix your butter with, uh, <laughs> if you're making mashed potatoes. or. But with that lid, nothing falls through. Can you see how that strainer separates that? And it allows the grease, the fat, the water, anything that you want to strain Smart. or drain off of your meats or anything that you're cooking, it goes right, right into your sink. Or... You can save it if you like, if Absolutely. you're like me. Um, by the way, our producer did confirm a couple of schools of thought on hsn.com, but we're going with, you know, not recommended for the oven at this point. So just keep that in mind. Vicki Lee, Kathy Jean, you know, you always bring so much light to my day. Thank you so much. Nancy, hello. Aaron loves that cook and look lid. Uh, Lynn. So June, I, I guess, you know, we're weighing in on two schools of thought. So at this point, we are, we're saying, Probably not in the oven, even though I'm seeing some other information on hsn.com. But what you cooking, John? Well, I've, it's got a steam release hole built into the lid. I want you to notice, you see this lid? Okay, you can't even see in here, and there's a reason. Okay, these are super greasy. Oh! <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm backing but away from that. They're delicious, and you can brown them this way in the pan. I'm gonna take it over right. here with the lid, and you, again, you'll notice when I have the, the lid on the pan, You'll notice the only steam coming out of here is through the release hole. Right. That's because this gives you a perfect silicone nice seal all seal. the way around that yep. pan, unless, now maybe on the red one, I don't know if we can come in close enough to see this. Okay. Can you see that little tab right there on the lid? That's your mark, right. okay? So you're gonna turn that right to the pour spout on the pan, okay. and now, I can pour out all oh, of that excess perfect. grease and but fat, do, do and you you'll notice. Sizzle, though? You'll notice I am not getting splattered. I would have. I'm not going to get those little, you know, those little uh, blisters on your arm from the grease splatter. Oh, right. Exactly. I don't have to worry about it now because that lid 
keeps that all inside. You can strain it right down to, look at this. Oh, wow. Perfectly brown. I would have And you'll myself. notice too, it's non-stick. I don't know if you guys can nice. see in there. It's wow. sliding around. Even the stuff, even the char is sliding around in there. That's how non-stick this absolutely. is. Absolutely. So Sharon, I didn't mean to confuse anybody and I apologize. Sometimes my producer can see information that I can't see because he's, you know, the omnipotent, <laughs> omnipotent Rick. And even though I was seeing something else on hsn.com, we did confirm, you know, not recommended for oven use. So that was not oh, to, good. Okay. you know, yeah. wasn't to mislead or confuse anybody. But uh, again, sometimes they can see information that I can. Uh, Olympia, great to have you there, Leo. And John, I got to tell you, as yes. always, you are a force in the kitchen, my friend. Oh, it's so much fun. Look at this. Our tacos are ready to go. Taco Tuesday tomorrow. Beautiful. Yeah. All right. With none of that grease, none of that oil, none of that fat. That's right. But, but all but of all that the goodness. flavor. Yes. We love that. And remember. Cut, cut the fat. Cut the grease. Exactly. You don't but, need but, it. But get all that taste and flavor. I mean, Sloppy Joe's, Taco Night, Meatballs, oh, yeah. Bratwurst. All of our full fat flavor favorites, but without that extra grease and oil. Also much safer in the kitchen as well. John, good to see yes, you. Yes, ma'am. It was a pleasure you. to be here. Nice to have you here. I'm going to throw some burgers on. Sounds good. Why not? <laughs> uh, thank you as always. Hey, don't hang up. Remember that teal is the most popular. And it's going to be a big night of food because coming up at midnight, it's officially our Christmas in July event. I'll actually be closing the event tomorrow at 9 p.m. But... Gianna's is here and they have this beautiful little Christmas village but if it's Gianna's you know there's good stuff inside all of those details are going to be coming up with Suzanne tonight at midnight so I'm going to feed the crew you can talk amongst yourselves and we're going to give out some chocolate okay and when we come back we've got oh really all right Okay, Keith is making out. Tim, okay, wait. Oh, good hands on Keith. All right, Becca, you ready? Okay. <laughs> At least they're not beads. Anyway, five and five, the Smeg, our smart deal, and more. So please stay tuned. We use goat milk because we had it, and that's how our company started. But what we learned over the years is how beneficial goat milk is, not only for the skin, but for your body. Goat milk adds moisture to your skin. It's really the most amazing ingredient. People really do notice the hydration of their skin. The farm to skin difference only with Beekman 1802. Discover a world of beauty like you've never seen before. Beauty Report is the insider's guide to getting gorgeous. Join me every Wednesday night for a beautiful new routine. The List is your go-to guide for our favorite fashion and accessory finds of the week. We have the best styles hand-picked just for you. Join us every Thursday night to see what made The List. Fresh take on timeless classics. For all women, simple, easy, elegance. Let's get it, let's get it! Style that works today, every day. Vanessa Williams on HSN. Celebrate HSN's birthday with an HSN card. Apply now and instantly get $25 off when you're approved. As an HSN card VIP, you'll get all kinds of birthday perks, like two extra flex every Wednesday in July, plus VIP financing, VIP easy returns, exclusive offers, and there's no annual fee. Apply now. Call 1-800-695-1418 or search HSN card at hsn.com. Hey, it's Vanessa Williams. Happy birthday, HSN. 42 years. So glad to be here. Sharon, Vicki, Lisa Lane, all of my kitchen booze and pan addicts in the house, thank you. And again, thank you for helping me clarify, not oven safe on the pan. I listen to the powers that be and not the voices in my head because... 
They're the boss of me and they shouldn't be. Uh, but you are the boss and the stars of this show. It is always your kitchen on Mondays at 8 p.m. So we are introducing, actually we did this last week, a five and five. So these are all very limited quantity items. We're to start with one of my personal favorites. I am a sucker for an electric knife. And this is more than just Thanksgiving. You get this great butcher's block design. And then the two different blades. What's wonderful about this, in addition to the fact that it's a terrific price of $34.95, they did it on a five pay flex pay for this show. $6.00. 99 cents we have the black silver last call or the red and whether it's being precise if especially if you're carving meat that has a very uh, low fat content things like pork tenderloin especially if you're doing it with a bacon wrap design perfect carving to that thanksgiving turkey this makes short order of it perfect and precise precision results every time with no guesswork whatsoever Hey, also available, I actually didn't get to sell this when Curtis was here a few weeks ago because it was completely sold out. So Rick, I think we were only able to secure like what, another thousand or so, uh, give or take. This is his famous, well, soon to be famous, smoker, roaster, and grill. Of course, if you don't know, Chef Curtis Stone actually started his career as a butcher. So when it comes to smoking and grilling your meats, it's got this double-decker design. So if you want to do smoking, you can put your wood chips on the bottom, huge dome, or if you want to roast an entire turkey, if you want to do smoke ham, smoke bratwurst, even his hamburgers that sold completely out as a today's special. This is here for $29.99, $659,990. Notice as well that you get the vent and you get precision and precise temperature control. So remember, not a lot of those to go around. Reduced shipping for this show as well. Uh, something else that, uh, honestly, Alicia, thank you for your forbearance with, with my, you know, trying to decipher multiple strains of information <laughs> in that pan. Uh, you know, there's a lot of stuff living in my head, trust me. This is one of the items that actually lives at my house because I love the flavor of grilled food, but let's be honest, whether you're afraid of the propane or the charcoal or you just don't have time, you can now grill in your microwave. I have done burgers on this. I have done chicken tenders on this. I think it's brilliant. These plates, I should point out, all dishwasher safe. I, I put mine on my uh, top rack. So we have the red or we have the silver. Comes with this great Kitchen HQ uh, time chart. I'll just give you a quick little example. Do you know you can do chicken in 10 minutes? Grilled chicken in 10 minutes. So not only is it faster, you're doing it in your microwave. So unlike most microwave food, normally you don't like to microwave chicken, but because it gets all rubbery, this gives it a nice serration, gives you those grill marks, and you know, gives you more of that grilled flavor and taste. It's really goof proof. It's a lot of fun, especially if you have kids going off to college. This is another fantastic opportunity. Art and Cook is a line that, well, they're artistic and they help us cook. <laughs> I mean, the name kind of stands for itself. This is their precision cutting board. It's terrific for those of us out there who might have uh, some dexterity issues. Actually, when you see the Brussels sprout salad that I posted, I did that all with my mandolin because you guys know I don't have very good um, uh, knife skills. So you are getting the two knives. Now you just choose, do you want it in the red or this great teal? So not only is it a great cutting board, but then you get your art and cook, the sheath with the five inch santuku. You get this beautiful pairing, or I guess you could also call this a utility knife. The, the serrations are great whether you're doing zucchini or cucumbers or tomatoes for that matter. Anything where you want really precise slices. There's even a small little cleaning brush included with your purchase to make it easier for cleaning. Boy, they, how did they know that just about everything on this table I have in my house, including the Walking Buck salt mills. Isn't this crazy? So this has almost 800 reviews. It's an HSN price of $29.95. Couple of things I love about this. It is bow and go. So these great little boxes come with it. You choose this gorgeous copper. We've got your brushed stainless, that beautiful metallic red or the pewter. You supply your own batteries and your own seasonings, but then check this out. You can adjust the grind, which is fantastic. I like um, a larger peppercorn on my steak, but maybe you want some fine sea salt on, on your fish. 
You can adjust that grind to coarse or fine. It's the push of a button so you don't fight with that old wooden thing. And then the addition of the light is also terrific because nothing spoils the romance like throwing on that incandescent lighting. Now you can actually see how you're seasoning. And let's be fair, seasoning is the key to great food, whether it's a salad, whether it's a steak, or even macaroni and cheese. So we are moving along. She's back. Hey. Carrie. Hey, you know, I love whenever you bring us something in the kitchen. By the Thank way, Carrie you. is going to be feeding everybody chocolates at midnight. I am. We're on new today's special. I look forward to being everyone's favorite person for 24 hours. You are. <laughs> well, you know she's one of our favorites in your kitchen. And Thank this you. is something I have wanted to get Smeg in the Your Kitchen show because... Yeah. First of all, I love retro designs. I'm yeah. kind of obsessed with kind of that 50s retro kind of look and feel. Yeah. But this is beauty, aesthetics, and power, just like Carrie, yeah. all under one great package. Thank you. And it's that Italian design. They've really evolved in our households. Yes. So they do things that nobody else does. That is kind of true, yeah. Since 1924, Smeg, out of Italy, had started off doing, they were an enamel company, and then they started making gas stoves Isn't that crazy? all the way in into then other appliances and refrigerators may be how you mostly know them because you've seen their beautiful 50 style refrigerators. But now small appliances like this beautiful, uh, you could call it a hand blender, you can call it an immersion blender, sure. whatever you like. But what we love about this is it has that wand that gives you that ability to take your blender to where you need it, right? So this is about portability. So if you've ever had that struggle about bringing out your big, huge blender, and then you have to take everything to the blender. This is different in that now you could take this to hot soups. You could take this, I actually saw someone made a comment earlier about RVs, that they love taking this on their RV For to sure. do all their blending requirements. So I wanna start off by just showing it off to you. So firstly, it's a beautiful stainless steel wand, okay? It has our flow blend technology. And that's and exclusive, That right? is exclusive, it's our patented technology that's gonna give you that perfect job every single time and give you that power when you need it. 350 watts of power, two buttons really to worry about. This is what I call your go button at the top right here, which gives it that go-go. But this is also your turbo button here. So that's going to give it that extra shot of power when you need it. And at the top, I'm going to turn around. It's got an ergonomic non-slip area here. So it really makes it easy to hold as you're working your jobs. But it's got several different adjustable speeds all the way across, which as I'm making things right now, you're going to see me use different speeds for different jobs depending upon what I need. So that is really it. We like to keep it simple at Smeg. We want to make sure that you have appliances that you understand. But also appliances that look beautiful, but then are powerful. So it's that, you know, that style with technology. So let's start with our mayonnaise here. Now I want you to think about something. Mayonnaise in and of itself, not hugely expensive for regular, but it's the moment you go gourmet. Oh, you're right. Right? But then you're buying just a small jar. And then the thing is, it never tastes as good as when you can make it on your own. So now I'm gonna ramp up. I'm holding my top button. So people always ask, so you've got oil. Oil. Right. Eggs. Eggs. We put in here our um, mustard powder. Okay. Uh, and we did a, a apple cider vinegar. Oh, nice. So you saw how quickly, now I'm gonna lift up and let this work its magic. And if you ever wanted to do a little turbo shot and a little pulse, you could do that. But just about, about a moment, you're gonna see it really thicken up. That flow bin technology is working to get in there and make this mayonnaise absolutely perfect. And uh, just, just for a frame of reference, when you see that aioli, it's a fancy name for charging you more money for mayonnaise. <laughs> I mean, that's basically what it is. Hey, by the way, Patricia Jean, thank you so much. It's, uh, you know how much I really do value you guys, and that means a lot to me. We try to always, full disclosure, and you know you're my family, you are my friends, and it's always fun to see and meet new friends in your kitchen every week. Dwayne, great to see you. Georgina, great to see you. Dwayne, have a great night. So let me just show you the colors here real quickly. So the blue, it is in last call. And I think th there are 75 of those. So you can see it really has that retro aesthetic, but it has the power that you want. Here's your cream, and it really is like a French vanilla cream. And then there's your black. And here's what Smeg did for our birthday. They did this great birthday box. It's, I, I don't know, for me, forget the blue box from the jewelry store. This is the kind of thing that I like gorgeous. to see. It's so gorgeous. That's a big deal that they did this. Even the gift box packaging has that thought thoughtful European aesthetic to it. And as part of our smart buy in very limited quantities, they are doing it not only with that flex pay, but you also get it with that free shipping. So, oh, oh actually, ta-da. That's oh. a special that they did for us, Carrie. <laughs> 
We pulled out the sound effects I just love for that. you. We pulled so, out all the sound effects. So as you were over there, I finished my mayo, but what I want to do is take the mayo to the next step. So maybe it's a tarragon. Maybe it's putting in, um, you know, what's the wasabi one they have for now. Sure. This is a chipotle. So I'm just going to actually oh, take my chipotle good. seasoning and I'm going to put it right here in my mayonnaise with my wand. So again, immersion blenders make it easy to make anything on the go. So now that this is done, I'm going to pull out and taking this off is very simple, by the way. So my cleanup is literally wiping off my top and then taking this over to a dishwasher. A absolutely. Uh, so Check that out. Uh, Sharon, you're right. Those microwave grills are terrific. This is wonderful for homemade sauces. I think for a lot of us out there, once you get an, in, 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 you know, a great immersion blender, you really kind of wonder how you did without it because you can do soups, you can do sauces, you can do smoothies, drink mixes, malts, mayonnaise, margaritas, and so the, the cleanup is ridiculously easy. In fact, if I would have had this at home, now I had to do my dressing for my shaved Brussels sprout salad the old fashioned way, but if I would have had this, uh, well, Victoria and I will be posting details uh, after the fact, but th this whole show is about healthy eating and an infusion, or I should say, uh, this immersion blender is a perfect way to do that because you're making it from scratch. You're only mm -hmm. putting things in it that you know are good for your body. If I would have had this at home, though, the dressing that I used, uh, toasted sesame oil, soy sauce, little rice wine vinegar and maple syrup, I could have done that easily if I would have had something like this instead of Absolutely. doing it by hand. Absolutely. And you saw just as Sheena was talking, I was just working it around. And you saw because of the flu blend technology, what actually was happening is it was pulling all of the larger pieces into my blade into that as blade. opposed to me having to search for them. So at the beginning, I like to kind of go down on the larger pieces and then I like to just let it come to me. And so this is actually a roasted red pepper and ricotta soup. So Carrie, that's one of the questions we ask. Can we use it in cold? Can we use yes. it in hot? Hot. That's the wonderful thing about an immersion blender that you can actually take it to your projects and take it into a hot pot without a problem. And that's what you can't do with a regular blender. So being able to make recipes on the spot and get them perfect without having to transfer them over. Like I used to make pea soup or like right, ratatouille and, put it in the blender. and different things. You have to do it in the blender back and forth and God forbid if it's hot and then you spill it all over yourself. So being able to actually take it right to the pot is a huge deal. So this soup is really light and refreshing by the way. Again, Great. it's a roasted red pepper and ricotta soup. It Ooh. has chicken broth, it has ricotta, it has cream, um, and then it has your roasted red peppers. And then I like to put a little smoked paprika in it, oh, by the I way. Oh, I like smoked paprika, too. And it gives it a little pop, so. For sure. Play with that. That's uh, a good it's one. It's so funny. Azuti, you know how much I love you. She's like, ooh, Carrie's not playing. She's got those sleeves rolled up. Uh, we came to play. We came to the party, Heck for yeah. sure. So we do see you, and um, you know how much we value you in your kitchen. Georgina, you're right. I would love a three-hour kitchen show. Mm -hmm. Dwayne, my best to meet uh, Ashley, and Selene, Georgina. Gina, all, Alicia, all of our Facebook friends, uh, Wendy, always great to have you guys here. We try to find great solutions in your kitchen, and I really mean it when I say you get one of these infusion blenders at home, and you really kind of think, you know, how in the world did I live without that? Yeah. Carrie, the thing is, so many of us want to do these green drinks, and you're right, normally it requires putting stuff in a blender and, or a food processor. There's a lot of cleanup. A lot of cleanup, lot right? Because then you have all the pieces and all the things to do. All that you have to clean up is your wand. Rinse that it is off. it. That's absolutely it. And actually, yep. I'm going to clean it off right here. I just did some soapy water, and this can show one possible way. And look at, as this shows the vortex of what's happening in here. I mean, look at the power. 350 watts of power, and it's not spitting it all over the place. It's True. actually taking it right down and keeping everything in the jar where it belongs. So what I love about that is it's just showing you how fast you can clean it so you can do some Something like that if you like. I'd put more water in it, obviously. Right. But um, or you can just stick it right in the top rack of your dishwasher. Obviously, you the motor hey, you don't. Carrie, you can you show down. everybody how easy it is to you just you twist yeah, and turn. Yeah, let me turn, show you on this one because right? so he's, he's nice and clean. But yes, there's actually some arrows at the back. I told you, Smeg is about keeping it simple for you. So you just line up the arrows. So here, this is the two arrows to put it on. So you'll just line up your arrows, it'll slide on, and then you'll lock it into place. So the fully like colored in arrow, that's the one that means you're locked in place. And again, simple to hold because of that ergonomic hold right here so it's got like a non-slip so I can hold this with one hand and get everything done right. that I need to get done uh, by the way TV Chad you know I love you uh, 
he, you're right. We love it when we see that free shipping. And Patricia Jean, you know, so lovely to have all of our, my Facebook friends here. Remember, this is your kitchen. And that, that free shipping and that flex pay they did for you for this show, 671076. Remember, if you want that retro baby blue, there are a couple dozen to go around. We also have that beautiful ivory. We've got the red and or we have the black. That gift box packaging was done for, just for you, for our birthday. Was that like, is it like a special This margarita? is an absolutely, this is a peach bellini. Oh, no kidding. Um, we put a little mango in there just to give a little mango oh, scent. But good. we put our ice in there. We put our Prosecco in there. We put our fresh puree and we put our uh, peaches, fresh peaches. So we're frozen oh, no peaches. Kidding. So however you want to do this, it's, it, it can take it all the way through breakfast, lunch, dinner. There's so many different reasons why an immersion blender really helps in the kitchen. One of those is if you've never made a fresh tomato sauce from right. scratch, I'm telling you, when you start having things, and a lot of what we're going to talk about here is things that are in the uh, jars or in the cans, that they've already been added with preservatives or artificial this and that. And the reason they have to do that is to keep it on the shelf. But if you have this, you can make fresh tomato sauce in a jiffy. So to wait for these to crush up, or I used to buy crushed tomatoes. Oh, sure. They never taste the same. It doesn't matter even if you get the great brands, as if you're doing it fresh. So if you can buy fresh tomatoes and crush them just like this, you see how I'm making a marinara sauce from hand, and then I can just let this go. So once I get a lot of my nice. big pieces, that's when I kind of roll it around. I'm going to turn up my speed a little bit and let it roll around. And it's going to pull all the remainder pieces right into, again, that flow blend technology is pulling it in and doing the job for you. I'm not sweating. Nope. Not I'm breaking not working sweat. hard. It's I'm true. just watching what's going on. And I say, okay, I'm good. That's I mean, but I want it. can you imagine that fresh marinara? Oh my gosh, it's, the smell on this is amazing. Smart, easy, fast, <gasps> healthier. It tastes better. We all know fresh is best, but if you're not doing fresh because it's kind of a hassle, then this is a perfect solution. Kay and Vicki and Alicia and Georgina and Selene, uh, <sighs> great to have you here. Leo as well and Sharon and Azudi, you be blessed as well. We um, love having love you in your kitchen. <laughs> and uh, again, it's, this is about finding smart solutions. And whether you've got kids at home, whether you're an empty nester, whether you just want to take a lot of the preservatives and the processing out of your food. Absolutely. The thing is, Carrie, even if you just use this for salad dressings yes. or for pesto, Which I do all the time. Salad dressings is where a lot of sugar hides. It's where a lot of um, calories it's hide. True. So if you're really trying to watch your weight and you think, oh, I'm eating salads. Why am I not having progress? There's a lot of sugar in those. Those salad dressings will get you every, and sauces, they'll get you every they single will. time. Pesto is simply oil. Uh, we put a little Parmesan cheese. We had our basil in here. Now you could use arugula, you could use kale, you can use, um, we use, I think today we use pine nuts, but you could use cashews I've used you before. Could. We used sunflower seeds the other night in a recipe. So here I did uh, a little ode to Italy. Oh, look so at that. So we have our pesto sauce and our red sauce. So there you go, the colors of Italy before yeah, you. For, oh, that is terrific. Hey, <laughs> remember that gift box, that beautiful birthday box packaging was done for you. They're doing it with that free shipping. Like my friend TV Chad says, it's hard to get that free shipping. We're doing free shipping. It is a smart deal of $99.95. Free shipping, 671076. Baby Blue, there are a couple dozen. We have that beautiful, almost like a French vanilla almond. The black or the red with that special uh, box design. Russ, have a great night. Gail, I'm so glad that you love that picture and we so love having you here in your kitchen. What is that, Miss Carrie? So I just made fresh baby food. So I just took oh. some peas and you can add various different things to it. But what I always what I want to show the difference of is the coloration. Here is what you could buy in the store and here is what we just made here. Do what you see difference. the difference in the color? This is vibrant and fresh that, that I just made. It smells so good and too. It, and, it, and that's the thing, the, the taste, the smell, the look, all of it will be different because it's fresh. And so when you have store-bought, they have to put preservatives. They have to they put do. things to keep it on the shelf. And then you don't know how long ago that was made. Same thing here. The thing I've been doing, and I'm sorry that it's the same green color, but um, I've been buying this green soup. Oh yeah. And it's organic. This is actually organic um, in the store, but what it simply has is the same things that are in here. Oh. Um, so it has spinach, it has broccoli, it has peas, and it has coconut cream. Okay. And the reason I love it is because I can't always get my greens in because I travel a lot. Oh, Obviously sure. I'm here with you guys. <laughs> <laughs> right. So I always want to get like a protein and a green, right? So the way that I can do that is to drink these soups because I just put them in a cup and I take them with me. Oh, that's a but great idea. But what if you could make this because you have your immersion blender? I love how this totally inspires me to really do recipes that I could buy in the store, but instead of buying them, I can make them fresh. And Makes again, sense. what I want to point out is when we're done with this, the coloration difference is 
vivid, it okay? Is. And right. that is because I am using the fresh ingredients. And you have to think, when you're using fresh ingredients, when you're doing it yourself, is there more stuff going on in there as far as what it's doing for you for the benefits? I have to believe that. And when you put this next to this and you can see the coloration, I'm hoping that you can see that there. I'll what a difference. I know, you know I know. it's more appetizing to the eye. Yeah. I mean, for sure. And exactly. You, you, and the thing is, then you're preserving all of those nutrient benefits as well. Absolutely. So we see you there. Remember, Smeg, that Italian, really kind of European sports car inspired design. Looks like a luxury automobile. Birthday <laughs> box pa packaging, free shipping, and of course, that five pay flex pay of $20. Yeah. Carrie, so what, an extended coffee break? Because you're coming back at midnight. Yes. Extended coffee break is a good way to put it. I yeah. know, right? I know. Fuel up. <laughs> Fuel up. I'll have to have some of this exactly. and some of that and some of that. Well, we'll look forward to seeing. Carrie <laughs> actually will be part of our Midnight Today special that hopefully you can see. Hey, I know our healthy trail mix. Sorry, Tim, I'm, I'm trying, I'm moving like the bionic woman. I'm channeling Lindsay Wagner. So the healthy trail mix popcorn was our recipe of the week, but I wanted you guys to see this. Since we were talking about healthy eating, the Brussels sprout salad, and I'm gonna be handing these out. I wish I could hand it to you if we did a live audience. I promise we will do that someday. But this, see James, you want something healthy? I mean, no kidding, you can't believe the flavor explosion. I'll be posting that later. <laughs> see, this is my kind of to-go cup. Well, thank you as always. You always make my night bright with your kitchen. Uh, we are continuing actually with coins in a moment, so stay tuned.